Hello ladies and gentlemen, in this video we're going to be comparing Instantly versus Smartlead. For those of you who are unfamiliar, Instantly and Smartlead are the top two cold email sending tools for B2B businesses and we're going to be comparing what's better and what situation should you go with which tool. But with that being said, let's just get right into it. Now I'm going to be comparing these tools on six total points. That's going to be pricing, API access, Unibox, warm up, the UI and UX slash mobile support and also the support team of both of these platforms. Now, I want to say something upright. I am not affiliated whatsoever with Smartlead or Instantly. Neither of these parties asked me to record this video, and I'm not being paid by any of these parties, and I don't have an affiliate link for any of these parties. I own a lead generation agency, and I've used pretty much every cold email sending tool, and I know for a fact that these are the two top ones, and I know which one I prefer, and I know why I prefer it, because I've used every single feature of both of these tools very, very extensively. Okay. Now I also want to mention that I've chosen these specific six points because of the fact they're the most relevant for people who know what they're doing in cold email. For example, instantly has a feature on their platform, which allows you to build lead lists directly on their platform. Now smart lead doesn't have that feature, but I wouldn't say that instantly is better in that situation because of the fact that anybody who knows what they're doing in cold email would never use Instantly's database. It is more expensive, it is not as good, it is not as accurate, and it's just not as convenient to use as something like Apollo. So I'm only really comparing the factors which actually make sense uh, and actually make a difference, okay? But with that being said, let's get into pricing. Now, number one, pricing, is the table you see right here. This is Smart Leads pricing. On the bottom here, you see Instantly's pricing. Now, the cheapest plan for both these platforms are pretty much the same. Smartlead is at $39 a month and Instantly is at $37 a month. Now, Smartlead is $2 more expensive than Instantly, but it gives you 2,000 active leads per, or I think 2,000 active leads total, right? Meaning at any given moment on this platform, you can have 2,000 leads in one campaign, right? Instantly, on the other hand, only gives you 1,000 active leads. Meaning even though Instantly is $2 cheaper, you're getting half of what Smartlead gives you. So I'd say that overall, in this situation, Smartlead's giving you a lot more for that price, okay? Then we gotta talk about the pro plan and the hyper growth plan. These are kind of the, the mainstream plans, they're the ones that are in the middle, and these are the ones that most people go for, okay? Now Smartlead's middle plan is $94 a month, and Instantly's is $97 a month. Now Instantly is $3 more expensive, but once again, Smartlead is giving you a lot more for your money. Smartlead is giving you 30,000 active leads, whilst Instantly is only giving you 25,000 active leads. Now, although it's not that big of a difference, you are getting 5,000 more leads for $3 cheaper. So I'd say that in terms of base pricing, Smartlead and Instantly are very similar, but Instantly, or I mean, Smartlead is slightly on top, okay? But... Here's the thing where Smartlead really, or here's the thing, and here's where Smartlead really starts to show its superiority. We're going to get right back to the video, but just give me a minute to tell you about Borks.io. For those of you who are unfamiliar, Borks.io is my lead generation agency that functions completely on a pay per qualified call basis, meaning you only pay us when we book you a qualified call with a prospect that wants to work with you. This is the same thing that we've done for Adam. We booked Adam nine qualified calls in just two weeks. Brandon, seven qualified calls in 10 days. We, we managed to get Jay six meetings and 37 interested prospects in 72 hours. We managed to get Damien five to 10 calls a week. We took Kareem from signing an extra three clients and extra eight clients. Tolly, we got Tolly one to two clients a day. Michael, 17 meetings in two weeks. Right here, 50 positive or 50 interested prospects. 48 interested prospects, 169 interested prospects, 99 interested prospects. On here, 50% of all responses, interested. Right here, 12.5% 12, 12 of all interested responses, interested. 16%, 22%, 29%, 61%, 11%, 27%, 8%, 27%, 13%. This is one of our calendars. Boom, a bunch of meetings. Right here, brand doing 100 to 300K a month. Right here, another brand doing 50 to 100K a month. Right here, another brand doing 10 to 50K a month. Right here, 5 to 10 headcount company. Right here, 16 interested prospects, 21 interested prospects. This is the case study of Jay Jones that I showed above. Right here, 50 to 200K a month. Right here, 20 to 50K a month. Right here, 20 to 50K a month. Another 500K per month plus. Boom, a bunch of meetings. Here's another one, $50,000 current MRR. Right here, $100,000 current MRR. 
50 to 100 thousand dollars MRR, right? The point is, is we know what we're doing when it comes to cold email. If you want more qualified sales calls on a paper qualified call basis, meaning if we don't get you calls, you do not pay us, then book a free outbound audit below. All we're going to do is discuss your offer, how your business works, and if it makes sense, we're going to give you an offer. Worst case scenario, you're going to get 30 minutes of completely free advice at no charge. Best case scenario, we're going to book you a ton of meetings and you're never going to regret it. But with that being said, let's get back to the video. Is when it comes to scaling. Now, Instantly's most expensive plan is the light speed plan, which is $358 a month. And that gets you 500,000 emails per month. Now, Smartly's most expensive plan is the maxed out expert plan, which is $25,000 a month and gets you 51 million emails per month. That is like a hundred times more than what Instantly offers, okay? Now, the expert plan is very convenient and it can very easily scale. You don't have to buy the $25,000 plan. They have everything from, here it is, everything from 90,000 leads all the way to 51 million leads, right? So as you can imagine, you can scale very, very easily with Smart Lead. Now, I'm sure that if you were to contact the instantly support team or the instantly sales team, they would allow you to buy a more expensive plan. But the point is, is there's no easy way of doing it. If you want to upgrade through instantly, you have to go and you have to contact their support. You have to talk to somebody and it's a roadblock. Okay. Whereas on smart lead, if you want to upgrade two buttons and you're done. So I'd say that if you are someone who owns a lead generation agency, or you are someone who wants to send a lot of emails, smart lead is the far, like so much more convenient when it comes to upgrading. Okay. Now again, smart leads flexible, Smartly's flexible pricing is a big appeal for specifically lead generation agencies and big companies. So unless you're looking to scale, then I guess this feature doesn't really matter to you. But again, also on the base plans, Smartly is slightly a winner. So I'd say overall, Smartly is the winner for this section, but moving on. So the next thing I want to talk about is API access. Now, API access is something that a lot of beginners overlook. Now, having a good API makes it possible to do anything you want with your cold email sending software. Now, whether it's building out a custom inbox manager or uploading email accounts or building out an automatic campaign creation flow or anything else that you can imagine, everything is possible under the circumstance your sending tool has a good API. Now, Smart Lead in the cold email world is infamous for having the best cold email sending tool API on the market. Instantly's API lacks crucial features like being programmatically able to create accounts, programmatically adding email accounts, programmatically managing active leads, and much, and they also give you a lot less data and a lot less analytics on their campaigns whenever you go and you fetch them with the API. Now, Instantly's API makes it very hard to create large scale automation projects, like for example, inbox managers. Now, in our agency, we actually have one of these custom inbox managers, which is built out completely in Airtable and the Smart Lead API. Now, I have a video on that individually, so if you want to go and you want to learn about that and you kind of want to see what I'm talking about, you can go to this document. It'll be in the description, and you can take a look at how that looks, okay? But for this category, I'd say that Smart Lead is the clear winner. Um, I mean, I guess if you're not necessarily looking to really scale, then I guess it's okay to use instantly, but... Again, it doesn't cost you anything to have that API and it makes it a lot more easy to scale. So I'd say either way, Smart Lead is the clear winner here. Moving on, the Unibox. Now, this part is very, like, very, very important, right? Now, both Smart Lead and Instantly have great Uniboxes. From a design slash UI perspective, it's purely based on personal preference. Um, personally, I'm completely indifferent on this point because I don't even use the Smart Lead Unibox because we have a custom inbox manager, just like the one I mentioned in the in the past section. But here is where it gets important. Smart Lead is known to have the quicker Unibox. And how fast you reply to positive replies is one of the most important KPIs in cold email. Now that KPI is referred to as your time to lead time to lead metric or time to lead ratio, whatever you want to call it. Um, and that basically just says like the faster you respond to your leads or specifically your interested leads, the bigger the chance you're going to book them in. Okay. Now in the past, because of the slow updates of both smart and instantly, people would use tools like Thunderbird to congregate their inboxes to have real time updates. 
Now, recently, Smartly released a crucial update, which significantly improved the speed of their Unibox. And now Smartly's Unibox is almost real time. They have a couple minutes in delay versus the 30 or so minutes that, for example, instantly has. Now, 30 minutes doesn't sound like that bad. You might think to yourself, like, whatever, you know, it's not anything major. But there is genuinely such a huge difference in responding to someone within the first three minutes and the first 30 minutes that simply doing that can make your campaigns three times more effective. And I've seen it happen dozens of times in Codema before, okay? So I'd say that purely because of this factor, if you're trying to take Codemo seriously and you're trying to scale this as a channel, having a quick uni box is extremely important. And here, again, Smartlead is the clear winner. Now, moving on. Next thing I want to talk about is warm up. Now, for those of you who are unfamiliar with what warm up is, I'm going to give you guys a quick brief. Basically, when you just buy email accounts, your domain has no reputation score. The ESPs, which are the email service providers like Google and Outlook, don't know whether to trust your email or not. So what happens? You start the warm up process and your email starts sending out all of a sudden a bunch of volume. And what happens, these ESPs start to think that, oh, this guy is spamming because all of a sudden he started sending out a ton of volume. Now, what, what ends up happening is the ESPs mark your emails as spam. And this is where the inbox or this is where not the inbox, but this is where the warm up process starts to really help you. They will start marking your emails as not spam and as important. Now, right now, if you go to your inbox like or you, on Gmail or, or Outlook, whatever you use, and you go to the spam folder, you'll be able to see that there's a button which says report not spam for all of the emails that went to spam, okay? And if you report those emails at not spam, their reputation score ends up going up. So what you're doing by using the warm-up feature is by force making your reputation good by purposely triggering the spam filter and then leaving the spam folder by having other users in the warm-up tool or in the warm-up pool mark you as not spam. And on top of that, they also mark your emails as important, which gives them even more reputation and also makes them stand out in a prospect's inbox. Now, both of these tools offer great warm-up pools and both of these tools offer unlimited warm-up in their core offerings. Now, this is what the smart lead warm-up looks like and this is what the instantly warm-up looks like. Now, they're very similar but I will say that Instantly is missing a crucial feature, which is the ability to randomize the amount of emails being sent out on a daily basis. Now, randomizing the amount of emails being sent out on a daily basis is a crucial feature because it makes you further masked from any anti-cold email like detections. And as you can imagine, a real person would never send out exactly 25 emails exactly every single day. That doesn't make any sense. A real person doesn't doesn't operate like that. A real person is going to send out some sort of range, maybe 10 to 25 emails. And that's what a real person would look like. Now, Smartlead allows you to allows you to do that. They allow you to give you a range in between where your cold emails will be sending. So if you set your range to say 20 to 25, you know, one day you'll send 20, the other day you'll send 23, the other day you'll send 22. Whereas on instantly, if you set your thing to 25, you'll always send 25. And that makes you just a little bit more prone to being detected by an algorithm. And therefore, as you know, deliverability is very important. I would say that Smartlead is the slight winner in this situation. Now, I'd say it's very close. I wouldn't say that Instantly's warm-up pool is bad. In fact, they probably have the second best warm-up pool out of any tool in the market. But again, because of that one feature, I will say that Smartlead comes out on top very, very slightly. Then the next point. Now we're going to talk about the UI, the UX, and the mobile compatibility of both of these tools. Now, both of these tools have a very good user experience on desktops. I'd say it's very hard to say which one is better because it's all subjective. My personal opinion is Smartlead. Obviously, if you guys couldn't tell, um, but I know a lot of people who would disagree with that opinion, and I know a lot of people who would agree with that opinion. So I'm not going to really talk about the desktop user experience because um, honestly, it's very subjective. But what I will say is that Instantly already has an app on both on both iOS and Android, which allows you to manage your inbox directly through your phone. Now, matter of fact, when I wrote up this document, Smartlead actually didn't have that. But just recently, I think it was actually yesterday, the day before, they released a official announcement that they're coming out to iOS and Android with a similar app like Instantly is where you're going to be able to manage your inboxes directly on your phone. And judging by the screenshots that they showed and the previews, it looks far better than what Instantly created. So, 
What I'll say here is at the time of recording, Instantly is slightly ahead because they do have that mobile app, but probably by the time you're watching this, then Smarly probably caught up and Smarly probably did it better because that's just what Smarly does. So moving on. Now we're going to talk about the support team. Now, both Smarly and Instantly have great support teams. They both offer live chat and dedicated support reps. And I'd say they're both almost the same, but personally, I've seen that Instantly does have a slightly faster reply rate. Um, just whenever you want to ask them in chat support, they seem like a little bit more quick. But what I have heard in the Smart Lead Slack, uh, it, that, that they're hiring a lot more support reps. They're working on that part of their business. So I honestly think that by the time you guys are watching this, it'll probably be around the same. But at the time of recording this, Instantly is winning in that category. But I will mention that Smart Lead also has a huge Slack channel where the community is very active. I'd say that if you're in cold email, even if you're using instantly, being in that smart lead Slack is a non-negotiable because that is a great place to get information on what's happening on the market, anything with deliverability, anything with different lead sources. It's a very good place to be. Um, so I will say that smart leads community is subjectively better than instantly's community from my personal experience, but instantly's support chat is a little bit better than smart lead support chat. So I'd say that in this category, they tie. Now, again, I do want to mention this one more time. I mentioned in the start of the video, I think that honestly, there's a lot of features that I didn't go into, um, which for example, one of the critical features people always ask about is the actual sending of the both platforms. I would say that both platforms are equally as good at delivering emails into the inbox. I wouldn't say that one of these platforms has better deliverability than the other platform. So that's why I didn't even talk about the core function of these tools really where they compete is on all of the secondary functionalities. But I'd say that both tools are equally as good at delivering in, or delivering emails into inboxes. Then there's other features like that lead database that I mentioned on Instantly, which I honestly would say that if you know what you're doing in cold email, it will not make a difference for you. So that's why I didn't really go into those features. I only went into the features that I actually deem important as a lead generation agency owner. And this is what I see most people talking about when it comes to Instantly or smart lead. But before we end off the video, I do want to just mention that if you do just want cold email done for you and you don't want to have to choose between instantly or smart lead, we do offer that on a paper qualified call basis, meaning we go out, set up your entire cold email process, go follow up with your prospects, send them emails, book them calls, and you only pay us if we put you on the phone with somebody who is a qualified prospect. Okay, so if that is something you're interested in, you can go to the Borks.io website. I'm going to have it as the first link in the description, or I'm going to have this document in the description. So you can go there and you can go in, book a call, and we can have a conversation. All it is, it's going to be like a 30 minute convo. Um, we'll just see that, you know, if your business is a fit, we'll discuss what you're currently doing for outbound. If you've ever done cold email, just bounce some ideas off each other. If it makes sense, we'll make you an offer. If not, you just got like 30 minutes of free advice. So win win, either way. But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe. I literally notice every single person. I think we have around 1,400 subscribers at the time of recording this. So again, we're still a small channel. I notice every single person. So if you did enjoy, like and subscribe. But until next time.